Brazil to become the second largest city to accept tax payment in crypto by 2023. Hello my crypto enthusiasts, welcome back to another video about a country accepting cryptocurrency. This time, we'll be talking about Brazil and how it bought crypto. I will also tell you a little about Brazil and the most famous city. Did you guess which city it is? Yes, it is Rio de Janeiro. Brazil is the most populous country in South and Latin America. Brazil is the world's fifth largest country by size and sixth most populated, with 8.5 million square kilometers and over 211 million inhabitants. Because of nearly a century of tremendous immigrations from all over the world, it is one of the most cosmopolitan and ethnically diverse nations. Brazil was a Portuguese territory until 1808, when the empire's headquarters was moved from Lisbon to Rio de Janeiro. The founding of Empire of Brazil in 1822 marked the achievement of independence. Following a military coup, the government became a presidential republic in 1889. Now let me tell you a little about Rio de Janeiro. After all, it is the most popular city. How could someone not talk about such a great city? Rio de Janeiro is the capital of Rio Grande do Norte, a Brazilian state. The Portuguese established it in 1565 as the seat of the Capitancy of Rio de Janeiro. A section of the city has been listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, where the Portuguese royal court relocated to Brazil in 1808. Its seat became Queen Maria's first of Portugal's court. Rio de Janeiro is one of the most visited cities in the Southern Hemisphere, noted for its natural surroundings, carnival, samba, and balanero beaches. Finally, it's time for you to know about Brazil's changes to include cryptocurrency. The mayor of Rio de Janeiro, Eduardo Pace, has confirmed that the city's proposal to invest 1% of its treasury in crypto has been adopted. The move aims to tap into the development that crypto investments can bring for the further development of Rio's economy. The city also declared the creations of the Crypto Investment Committee, which will continue its work from where the Crypto Rio report stopped to pave the way for 2023. Chang Peng Zhao, the CEO of Binance, announced that the crypto exchange worldwide would be establishing a former base of operations within the city. Do you know what Binance is? If not, then watch the next part of the video very carefully. If yes, comment below and let me know what you think about the company. Binance is the world's largest cryptocurrency exchange in daily trading volume. It was established in 2017 and is based in the Cayman Islands. Binance was investigated by the U.S. Department of Justice as well as the Internal Revenue Service in 2021 on charges of tax evasions and money laundering. Binance was further ordered by the United Kingdom's Financial Conduct Authority to cease all regulated business within the United Kingdom by June 2021. Let me also tell you a little about the CEO of the company. He is the founder and the CEO of Binance the largest cryptocurrency exchange in terms of trading volume globally. Zhao formerly worked as a chief technical officer of OKCoin and was a team member that created Blockchain.info. According to the Bloomberg Billionaires Index, Zhao is the world's 13th richest person with a net worth of $77.3 billion as of March 1, 2022. In 2014, he sold his Shanghai condominium for around $1 million to invest the proceeds in Bitcoin. Let me tell you a little about who the current CEO of Binance is. The founder and CEO of Binance, the largest cryptocurrency exchange in terms of trading volume globally. Xiao formerly worked as the chief technical officer of OKCoin and was a team member that created Blockchain.info. According to the Bloomberg Billionaire Index, Zhao is the world's 13th richest person with a net worth of $77.3 billion as of March 1, 2022. In 2014, he sold his Shanghai condominium for around $1 million to invest the proceeds in Bitcoin. We have reached to the end of the video, but the video will be incomplete without telling you all how Brazil has influenced Latin America. The acceptance of cryptocurrency, particularly Bitcoin, as legal cash is gaining traction throughout Latin America. Brazil, Paraguay, Argentina, Panama, Mexico, and Cuba have begun to discuss making cryptocurrency lawful money. The attractions for the government has been in attaining financial inclusions for unbanked residents and lowering the cost of remittance, a vital source of income for them. That ends the video. Comment below and let me know if you have invested in cryptocurrency before. If yes, what made you think about investing and when did you do it? Did your returns meet your expectations or were you disappointed? Let me know in the comment section below. Also, if you have any tips for our newbies in cryptocurrency, do share them as they would be helpful for them. With that, I'm going to end the video. I hope you enjoyed the video as much as I enjoyed making it. Please leave a like and comment below. Also, consider subscribing to our channel for more such videos. Thank you.